Shalom, shalom. Koholoyim la Yahweh b'Hashem Yahweh Shai b'Hashem Rakak Wadash. The honor to the head elders, the apostles, and bishops of Great Millstone. Shalom to you, Akim here in abroad. To Brother Yarzayan, back with another short lesson. Lord willing, you had a five bench session. You know, just thinking, man, listening to brothers' videos. You know, just meditating. You know, in the spirit and uh thought came to mind that yeah the fearing of the lord will bring us to victory fearing the lord will bring us to victory because this world is through everything in this world everything you've been taught all right is not conducive to uh to uh life man you know being in a in, a, in an american mindset that's that 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 <laughs> That, that that spirit that comes with being an American, all right, is totally through. You know, you know. Uh, example is, you know, you got to eat three square meals a day in order to function. You know, the the undisciplined, the undisciplined lifestyle, all right, that is pushed and forwarded. You know, over hypersexualization of every damn thing. You know. There's a saying that goes, uh, everyone will feel two pains, the pain of discipline or the pain of regret, you know? So I want to read these scriptures and, uh, you know, paint that picture, you know, that fearing Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai will bring the victory everything else we're going to see very soon in living color what the american way is going to bring man all right and we already know what's going on concerning the whole situation with you know the v's all right and the j's you know what i'm saying this is matthew 6 and 21 for where your treasure is there will your heart be also that's a mashiach yahushai speaking all right, where is your treasure? Is your treasure in how much money you got? Your you know, lust of your eyes, the lust of your flesh? You know, what's, what's, how are you going to be able to create more money and, you know, and a uh, comfortable lifestyle for yourself here in America? Or trusting and believing in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai? Where is your heart? You know, where is your mind? So we know the world mind those that are not in this truth and reject this truth and don't believe in this truth we know exactly where their minds are where their hearts are at man. Matthew 12 35 a good man out of the good treasure of, it, of the heart bring it forth good things yeah uh, look at the rulership what's, what's good come from this rulership under the Edomite I'll let you answer that and, and an evil man out of the evil treasure bringing forth evil things. Now that is exactly explaining where we are. Look at all of this evil going on in the world. Look at all of this guile, all this deception, all this filth. Look at what it's causing. Luke 6 and 45. A good man out of the good treasure of his heart bringing forth that which is good. Same thing. And an evil man out of the evil treasure of his heart bringing forth that which is evil. For the for of the abundance of the heart, his mouth speaketh. And once again, Luke 12, 34, for where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. So I just wanted to exhort, and Lord willing, it's edifying to you, Akim, and few sisters that sincerely believe in, in uh you know this faith and believe in this faith of Yahweh by Shimei Shad, with all your mind, body, and your soul, that fearing the Lord. Yahweh Bashim and Shai will get the victory. These people are not going to win. They're going to end up with karagmas, jabs, V's, Victoria's Secrets. They're going to end up with thermal nuclear fire. So let's fight the good fight of faith to endure to the end. Shalom. And not receive that damn judgment with the rest of the world. Thank you.